Hey y'all, here's how to make this fabric sunflower sun. I got this wood blank from Dollar General and first I'm just painting this white and then I'm going to make it a little bit rustic using this distress ink and the color is walnut stain. At first I'm just using a cloth to apply it because I don't want it super heavy. And this yellow fabric I got from Amazon and once you do cut a little slit in it you are able to just tear off pieces from it. And next I'm using some thick twine to create the centers of our sunflowers using the same technique that I've used for my bunny placemats. I cut down my fabric strips into tinier pieces so that they would fit within the sun. So it's just a matter of adding some hot glue and then just layering your fabric strips to create a sunflower look. And when you flip it over, you can check to see if there's any spaces that you need to fill in. And once you're all set, you can go ahead and glue it into your sun. And just to add a little greenery, I'm taking these fake leaves and cutting off the edges a little bit just so that they fit nicely up underneath our petals. I've decided I should probably show the sign here just in case I mess it up on these next steps. Because through this whole project, y'all, I wasn't sure of how it was going to turn out. I just kind of was going with it and thankfully it all came together. So I decided to make it a lot more rustic and I wanted to add some little butterflies and I had these vintage paper butterflies so I thought they would be perfect so I just cut out the shape of them and then just bent them a little bit so that they looked like they were kind of like sitting up like regular butterflies and then just did a little dab of hot glue and glued them right onto my flower. And I just got this stamp off Amazon so I decided to use it as well and just do a little bit on the corners and kind of brush it out a little bit to just fade it out on the edges and give it more of like a vintage style. So all in all, I think this sign turned out beautifully. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and thank you so much for watching.